Hi, in this video, we will study how does the credit card market of India look like? What is the trend of pause spend where you go and swipe your card? What is the trend of online spend when you make purchase online? We are going to study value as well as volume. When I say volume, it actually means number of transactions, number of times people are using the card and value means what is the purchase value, spend value. So let's get going. I have kept the tool open for the study and I'm going to just load this data that I just showed you April 22 to June 24 in this particular system. So let me load this data and show to you. So I'm going to just make a regular visual analysis because that's the purpose. I'm not going to do any forecasting or supervised machine learning here. So I'm just selecting this data that just I just showed. And now let's just do the study of those four parameters. So I'm going to study bank name one, which is summarized. Only big banks are here. I'll do month over month study of the trend that how does it look like and let's take four metrics so here i will take credit card transactions value and then credit card transactions volume how many transactions are happening then let's take credit card transactions value of pause how much spend is happening on pause and how much spend number of transactions are happening on pause so all these force are has been selected so let's see that how does the trend look like i will not do row wise study i will rather do column wise study so that i know how these are looking like and i can just leave the column total let let it remain like this here the column total will obviously become color wise because uh, this will be the sum total so this will be max let me remove the column total because then it will give the correct picture that which is the biggest player here obviously hdfc is the biggest player but take a look at the graph we'll directly take a look at the graph so you see the graph this is the online value you can see it looks like almost a abrasion here this is sbi card 2310 so essentially october 2023 and it looks like a seriously big jump here just in comparison of their months and same goes for icici icici also has big jump in october 23 but if you look at other player like here it jump but the jump is not that big so biggest jump has come in sbi card case followed by the percentage jump is in ICICI. Axis is so it jump but I won't consider it even that big or probably in percentage terms also it's like probably at par with what we are seeing. So at least these three players are showing some abrasion in October 23 when it comes to online spend. But take a look after that this is almost static from last few months and actually much less from the month of March 23 or Feb 23, uh, 24 kind of. But this has not gone down so much. This is also like has gone up but almost static but not to this level. But the decrease in case of SBI card from January 21 level is quite huge which is not happening in case of ICICI and HDFC or Axis. Look at Kotak, it is almost a constant upward jump. However, it's not a very big uh, increase kind of thing, but a constant jump is there. Indescent, almost static online. Other player taken together also showing some what increase. I'm going to put these figures, these charts, as well as these tables in my blog on the website, and I'm going to put that link in the description so that if you are interested you can just go to the blog to study that number 
Now look at the number of transactions. This is very significant because if you see number of transactions, in case of SBI card also it is increasing. The value was not, but the number of transactions are increasing. It means almost it's a retail stuff. And same goes for ICIC. It's almost even bigger than HDFC. Not in purchase value, but in terms of number of transactions, it's even bigger than HDFC. Access almost static. SBI card is jump. This is somewhat jump. This is also like almost I'll say static cotech. On the contrary, Indus Indy is showing some jump from last few months. And ICIC obviously is clear cut jump. Now take a look at the POS. In POS, HDFC is in comparison of online, if you look at, it looks like, you know, it is, it doesn't look like double. But take a look here and here if you are talking of the last one, you know, it is almost like probably 1.5 times or 1.4 times kind of. But take a look at when it comes to POS, it is almost double. HDFC is almost double or 1.8, 1.9 times, you know, here. If you take a look, it's 92 and here it is 157. So quite almost 60, 70 percent kind of jump. So uh, HDFC appears the strongest when it comes to POS. SBI card is also showing a constant increase. Others are showing, Kotec is showing, ICC is showing somewhat. Lit slope is not huge, but at least it's showing somewhat increase. Whereas SBI card and others are showing huge jump. HDFC was doing good, but from last few months, it's almost static. And same goes for Axis. This is also almost static from last few months. ICIC jump, but here again static somewhat. But overall, I can say that here you can see it's a clear cut jump. It's a clear cut jump if you put a long term trend and same goes for access barring this particular area. But take a look at the POS transactions. In case of when it POS transactions, HDFC is almost like from here it has gone to a different level. And same goes for others when other small players if you remove SBI, RBL, Kotak, Indusind, ICIC, HDFC, City I have taken just because City merged from Feb 22, Feb uh, 23 or March 23 to this place and that's why it is showing jump, that's why I have taken. If you remove this, then this is everything goes into others. So you can see but in pause it appears that HDFC is doing damn good, whereas SVA card appears little on decline, this is upward. All are, are upward, but SBI card appearing decline, and even this appears almost static. In pause, if you take a look, SBI card is in fact even bigger than number of transactions is bigger than ICICA. Whereas spend by is not. Spend by is almost almost at the same level. So that's that appears very interesting that who is strong where. I'm going to put everything on the blog and even this table on the blog take a look feel free to let me know what do you think thank you for watching